Mike Swainson's mill has been in business for so long. How many years? 40 now? Nearly. Nearly. Yeah, a long time. Paul Swainston started that so many years ago, and the quality has kept it going on and on. Second generation. He's trained his sons well. Very good. All right. Well, let's look at some of the work that you do. I know that you're very detail-oriented. In fact, you're the lead designer, residential designer here at Swainston Mail, and you're located in Preston. You might think that's a long ways away, but you know, I thought it was going to take me a while to get out here. I was here before I knew it. Very quick with four lanes. Yeah, it's fantastic. The drive was great, and so even if you're looking for cabinet work, they have a great website that you can get on, and you don't even have to come out here, although I recommend you do because it's a beautiful showroom. But let's look at your website and talk about that for a minute. Okay, very good. I'm just going to show a few pictures. Can we do that? Yes, absolutely. And in fact, it's swainstonmill.com, correct? That's right. Okay. I wanted to start out with just a little detailed picture, Laura, that of the early childhood building that we completed up at uh, Utah State. Uh, university. We do a bit of work up there. Well, you know, isn't that fun? What a fun little bench for children, and I love the fun colors, too. Well, I wasn't the interior decorator, but um, the detail work that the uh, architect required of us made it a lot of fun. Okay, now this, this one is fantastic, because I can see this kind of element going into a woman's workroom, sewing room. Look at the wrapping station. Hold everything. Uh, this is like the whole something of the operations I think that the ladies are working on these projects for their kids up there. I love that. So these are great ideas. So if you want to put even some of this commercial, that's a commercial place, but if you want to put some of those ideas into your home, you can do that for these women. Always. And men. Yeah, that's right. Always like that answer. Okay, let's go on. Okay. Oh, I, a cameo shot of a couple of my guys um, uh, busy installing here. They didn't know I was watching, but I, I took this picture and I got back and I go, I'm looking at it and I go, oh, yep, they put down their pads, they're protecting the floor, they're doing all the things they're supposed to be doing. Uh, they're professional. And that's where we talk about the quality of work and the attention to details. You're not just going in there, slapping it down, throwing it in. No, we're helping to create a home. Absolutely, and I love that. And, you know, as we look through these pictures, let's talk about some of the detailed work. Oh, in fact, look how gorgeous that is. Uh, just newly completed. Um, cherry is affordable if you allow a few knots. Well, and I love the knots. It adds some distinction to it. But the attention to detail, I mean, on your cabinetry, talk a little bit about you, you uh, use dowel system, and you're, they're strong. They're built to last. Yes. Um, the uh, preferred method for putting cabinets together um, in the European system is dowels, the way the Europeans do it, um, for a number of reasons. But the end result is a stronger cabinet. And so your dowel actually isn't in the, it's in that particle board part. But Tell in the softer it. part of the particle board. Okay. We, we don't plow out the hard part of the particle board. So it, a, again, you, you do your joints, we run our tests, it just holds a lot better. Gosh, you love that because you don't have those sagging cabinets after a few years. Absolutely. Okay, let's look on. Okay. Um, just... Rustic alder is still popular, and uh, we still do quite a bit of it. Well, and you'll actually help with design out here as well, right? Absolutely. Yep. Spent years doing it. Um, had uh, national training and try to make it work for mm -hmm. people. And so you've got a lot of different options. There's the white cabinets as opposed to the, the natural wood. This is gorgeous. Some people like to work with an interior decorator. I hope mm -hmm. Marty Cannon wouldn't mind if I say, you know, this is one of her designs. She wouldn't mind at all, and she's a fantastic designer. So, she's she's yeah. wonderful. Um, so there's a few. Oh, yeah, show this. This is okay. great. I was looking at this picture the other day, and uh, Larry, our door maker, um, took a board, evidently, and made it into the drawers, and he started out with some light colored wood here in a hickory. Mm -hmm and ended up with it over here, and it's almost symmetrical. It's, it's just what he does. See, that takes it from just a builder to a craftsman, an artist, that takes the time to look at the grain and create that. That's gorgeous. And we are one of the few uh, cabinet shops in the valley that makes their own doors. Oh, see, I love that, too. See, again, it's the detail, it's the knowledge to know what you actually do different than other cabinet makers. Mm -hmm. And when you come out here to the shop, you'll see that you've got a clean shop, you're together, you're working in order. Absolutely. Our yeah. guys our guys are craftsmen. Okay. They are real cabinet makers. Love that. In fact, while we're looking at some more pictures, let's talk about talk about craftsmen. You guys are quality certified. Tell me about that from the company which you are quali quality certified. Well, it's an association that we belong to, Architectural Woodwork Institute. 
and um, it was quite an achievement to, to become quality certified and that helps us with our commercial projects. Um, there's a lot of ramifications there but the end result is is that they'll follow you every step of the way from your beginning paperwork to your to your cleaning up and if you follow things precisely you can um, well that's part of receiving that certification and retaining it. So some might be members of but not quality certified because you can be a member of that group but not be certified. You have to have, have a continuing standard of excellence, I suppose, to get certified. Absolutely. Um, in the Valley, uh, currently, we're the only ones. Oh, very good. I love it. Well, right here at Swainston Mill, so tell us we are impressed and easy to find. You're on the main highway. Yes. Absolutely. North End. Yep. Right there as the split goes. And Across from the Burger King. Oh, very good. Well, Mike, thank you for showing us the cabinets that you do and some of the artwork you do. Check out their website. It's fantastic. That is... SwainstonMill.com. Okay, with an O-N, SwainstonMill.com. Thanks so much, Mike. Thanks, Laura. Appreciate you visiting. Thank you.